Good evening, everyone, and welcome to your channel. What are your tales and tips? Yes, guys, again, I'm here with a really new and very tasty dish for you guys. Yes, its name is uh, noodle chicken sticks. It's uh, like a little bit similar like chicken chow mein, which I have uploaded in my uh, previous um, videos. So it's uh, the different is coriander and spring onion which is not added in chicken chow mein. So we have uh, some coriander, like um, uh, 300 gram coriander and 300 gram um, spring uh, onion, uh, half kg um, carrots, half kg green uh, capsicum, half kg red capsicum one kg uh, breast uh, chicken breast which i have sliced it like this in a two uh, in a very uh, thin uh, layer as you see guys and um, here is one kg cabbage which is which i have sliced it like that and then we need some uh, noodles uh, so the reason that i took this small packet because uh, we are not using too much um uh, flour bread or these things so it's enough for us so most of uh, the thing uh, is uh, vegetables and here we have some herbals like here is cumin and uh, turmeric salt cinnamon dried garlic uh, and then here is garam masala uh, so these are the things guys so let's start it Yes, guys, so I'm going to, uh, first of all, uh, stick uh, each uh, ingredients one by one in this um, thing. Then after that, uh, I'm going to uh, mix them together. So uh, I'm going to add a little bit oil, not uh, like uh, too much oil because then it will be really too oily uh, because I'm going to um, fry all the things one by one. So then at, at, at the end, it will be lots of like, you know, um, oily. Uh, so that's why I'm just uh, trying to uh, fry one by one. So first of all, I'm going to uh, fry cabbage because a cabbage takes a lots of time. So that's why I'm going to put it in uh, this pan and uh, then uh, mixing it well until it's uh, getting uh, its uh, nice texture. And uh, one thing which is really important, guys, it is like. Uh, um, I'm going to add a little bit uh, salt in each ingredients. The reason is that um, our most of the vegetables, uh, like we can say all the vegetables, capsicum, carrot, cabbage, uh, they are uh, like uh, tasting a little bit sweety or sweet. Uh, so that's why if I add um, some salt, uh, so then uh, at the end it will be completely uh, fine and it will be really tasty so we are waiting for that at uh, it's getting a little bit um stick then after that we're going to put them in the big one uh, the big um, uh, pan or something like that then after that we are going to mix them all together so be with me guys yes guys as you see so this is almost done then I'm going to wait a little bit more until the water is soaked, as you see the water in here. So until the water is completely soaked, uh, then we are going to put it in a big um, grita or pan or something like So yes, like this, we are going to wait for uh, a little bit more minutes. Yes, guys, uh, so cabbage is ready. Now we're going to put that in a big um, pan or grater like that. So be with me, guys. Yes, guys, as you see, so I have put it in this big jar or big uh, grater. Or, uh, so then um, 
I'm going to let it a little bit be uh, cold then until I'm making I'm sticking uh, the other stuffs so it will be cold and when I'm making when I'm when I will mix them uh, so then it will have a really beautiful and nice texture and they will uh, mix in a very fantastic way with uh, to be to, together yes guys so now it's turn for uh, chicken so I am not washing uh, the pan so uh, because I don't need it and now I'm going to add um, chicken. I'm going to add, uh, or I have added chicken. Then I'm going to mix it well. That it should be staked in a very good, um, like, in a very good way. Like that uh, until it's uh, all the chicken are getting like this uh, white color then we are going to add our uh, herbals and chicken then uh, again we will uh, mix it or put it together with uh, cabbage so one by one we are going to fry them like that and when it is uh, fried or staked then after that um, uh, we are going to put them in another uh, dish, which uh, the big one, the big dish uh, with the cabbage is. So it will be really nice. And um, until I'm uh, sticking chicken in here, so I have uh, put uh, noodles. I have put the noodles uh, that it should. Uh, get boiled then um, one thing which is really important guys don't boil the noodles 100% uh, just uh, try to boil, uh, boil it um, 60 to 70 percent because then when you are uh, staking it then it will be really nice and really good and um, while you while uh, the noodle is boiled and it's ready so try to wash it uh, with um, very cold water then it won't uh, then it it will not be uh, too much sticky guys so as you see guys it is now um, the chicken is almost like uh, ready to add some herbals then again we are going to stick it until you see guys until uh, the water which is uh, here so the water should be soaked then after that our chicken is ready then we are going to put it in the that big dish so yes guys i'm going to mix the herbals and then we are going to wait for around um, uh, four or five minutes then it's ready yes guys so the chicken is also staked and it's also ready so i'm going to put it uh, in that big dish with uh, cabbage so yes let's go guys so yes guys as you see so the kitchen uh, i'm sorry <laughs> the chicken i have uh, add the chicken also in this big dish and i'm letting it until it's getting a little bit cold while i'm frying the other um ingredients let's go yes guys so again i'm going to do the same procedure a little bit oil but this time i'm going to add red capsicum green capsicum mix together while uh our capsicum get a little bit softy then after that what we are going to do we are going to add our spring onion with capsicum also so i'm going to add a little bit uh, salt salt in it because uh, this, these uh, red and green capsicums they are really sweet 
so they taste sweet so with salt it will be good or I can do one thing uh, else I'm going to uh, add our uh, spring uh, onion uh, while I'm going to uh, fry the noodles so when I'm going to uh, add a spring onion and coriander with uh, the noodles then it will uh, taste really good and it will um, look really good this guys so it's um, you don't need to cook uh, capsicum a lot uh, or stick it uh, too much then while we are going to mix all the ingredients together then it will be broken so that's why uh, just some more minutes and that's it yes guys uh, so our capsicum is ready again I'm going to add it with uh, chicken and cabbage with that big dish uh, sorry with no in that big dish like that yes guys so as you see uh, this is uh, another layer layer of uh, capsicums so while everything is completely ready I'm going to uh, stake the noodles at the last then when the noodle is also ready then I'm going to mix it and uh, then put it uh, on the oven for um, five minutes in a very low flame then it's ready yes guys so now it's turn of carrots uh, our carrots will uh, stick very soon because it's really thin and again I'm going to add some salt on carrot but uh, not now first I have to mix it well and stake it a little bit then after that I'm going to add some salt in it yes guys as you see so the carrots are also completely staked now I'm going to add it in our that big uh, dish as you see guys so I have add uh, our carrots also in this big dish now <coughs> now is the last step uh, our noodles so let's done with our noodles yes guys so our dish is uh, this is uh, warm and now it's time for um, Staking our noodle, um, but this time for noodle, I add some a um, little bit uh, more oil. You see, guys, you have to move your hand as faster as you can because the noodles will be uh, sticked in uh, this uh, pan. So try to move your hands as faster and put it in a low flame. Then now I'm going to add a little bit of uh, salt in it like that. I'm going to <coughs> add our spring uh, onion like this. Try to try to move your hands faster, faster. Uh, then it will be really good and it's it will be really sticky. And what I'm going to add in here is I'm going to add a uh, soya sauce, which uh, make it really like really tasty guys it's really when you're going to add a uh, soya sauce in your uh, noodles so it gives a really special uh, taste 
uh, to the noodles. Yes. So, like this. So our noodles are almost uh, staked. Now what I'm going to do is I'm going to add coriander in it. Going to mix coriander. Then after that, it's uh, ready to mix it with um, uh, with the whole um, ingredients which we had. So this is the last step. Yes guys, be with me till the end. Yes guys, so all ingredients are in this big dish. Now what I'm going to do, I'm going to mix it with this one. Really gently and really slow. And I have uh, put uh, the flame, uh, the oven in a really slow flame. Like this. You see guys I'm going to mix it like that and then like this very very gently very slowly because all the ingredients are cooked then um, I don't want it should be like broken or something like that so be careful with uh, while you're mixing it so be careful with it yes guys so it is almost um, mixed so what we're going to do is we're going to wait for four five minutes until if it's it's it have some water or something like that it will be completely soaked and as you see guys um there uh, there is um, lots of vegetables just noodles are very in a very small amount and that's why i said uh, that uh i made lots of vegetable but a little bit noodles because it's not good but just uh, uh, the vegetables are the best Yes, when it's ready, when I dish it out, so I'm going to show you guys. Guys, so the dinner is ready. The uh, chicken noodle stick is ready, guys. And I hope you like it and try it once. And those who are new in my channel, please don't forget to subscribe my channel and share it with your family and friends. And one thing more, I'm going to show you guys something which i made it but i forgot to uh take the um to show you guys the recipe this is made of eggplant it's really delicious it's really tasty always while we are making something like uh barbecue chocolate or these things so we are always making this one uh so have a nice time take care guys bye bye